What's up guys, today I want to share with you an intro template pack for DaVinci Resolve and it is absolutely free. Now before we begin this video, I just want to say that I received a lot of support for the previous pack that I did for DaVinci Resolve, that was the minimal title pack. So I had to keep my promise and release a new freebie for you guys. I really want to thank you whoever contributed for the previous pack. You guys are really amazing. Now it'd be really cool if you show the same love and support for this pack as well. Now with that being said, I'm going to show you how we can edit this template. So open up DaVinci Resolve and on the project manager window, you just right click and click on restore project archive and just search for your logo reveal pack .dra folder. Click on open. Once that opens, you will see this thumbnail, double click on that to open it up inside DaVinci Resolve. Now you might want to relink some files, so you can right click in the media pool and click on relink clips for bin. And browse for the same folder where you have these files and DaVinci Resolve will automatically relink all the other clips for you. Now that's done, we can go to logo reveal folder 1. Once you open the folder, you can see you will have the preview file over here as well. So you can scrub through it and see if you like the animation or not. And if you like it, then right next to it will be the timeline for it. I'll just double click on that and it will open it up at the bottom. You can see the fusion composition over here. Now to edit it, just click on it and go to the fusion tab. And here is how this animation has been created with all these different nodes. Now we just want to change the color and the logo and uh, the text. So we're going to start at the very top. So we have this paint node over here. You can just select that and go to the modifiers on the top right side. You can see the modifiers over here and you can just change the color of this paint node over here. And you can do the same thing with other paint node as well. So you can change the colors of these nodes and then we have the background color which is set to black but you can change it to any color that you want then we have this node as well it's actually a paint node so you can just right click and uncheck show thumbnails you can see that it's a paint node uh, i have renamed it to change color again go to modifiers just go forward in timeline so we can see this animation it's this color over here the pink color but you can change it to anything that you want all right next is this logo image node over here so you can just replace it with your own logo so let me just find a logo over here so I can just use this DaVinci Resolve logo, drag and drop it on top of this node and click on replace, um, click on OK. You just have to connect this logo image with this merge and that's it. Now if you want to change the color of the logo, you have the change logo color node and you can just choose any color that you want. Then there is this text and you can just change it with anything and you can just write any text, you can change the color and the font as well let's edit the logo reveal 4 you can check the preview over here and just double click on the timeline to open that up i'm going to click and just go to the fusion tab i'm going to actually use a different logo with a different dimension so i'm just going to use this logo you can see the dimensions is pretty big i mean this logo is pretty huge so i'm going to drag and drop it on top of this node and replace it like so. Now I'm going to connect it with this merge and you're going to notice that it's going to get cropped up but we can go to merge 4 and we can increase its size so we can see the whole logo and then we have this transform 2 over here and we can use that to resize it back in the center like so. And now if you play this you can see that your animation will work just fine. Now the same thing, you can go to background and uh, change the color of uh, these shapes. Finally, export this animation from the deliver tab over here and you can render it out and uh, use this in your own videos. So yeah, thank you so much for watching the video and as always, download link will be in the description. If you really like the work, then consider supporting this by making a small donation. But it's completely up to you, you can download this for free as well. So again, thank you so much and I will see you guys in the next one.